the stage, man. You should be one of those uh, female comedians. What? Uh, how people think I'm a streetwalker? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I uh, I um, please accept my apology for impugning your virtue. <laughs>
like I said, I'd just like to, uh, to talk for a while. That's quite all right. The other gentleman is here. You want to talk to or rather you wanted to hear me sing? <laughs> I mean, that's fine. I just wish you'd pay me. That's all. I'm behind in my rent. I'll, I'll pay you, Mary. Don't worry. Yes. Yes, I The other gentleman Don't mind me saying, Mary, he may have been a good man, but if he was a collier, then... Oh, he couldn't buy me nice things or yeah. let me dress like the world thinks is a proper lady. I know that. But that didn't matter. He made me feel like a real lady. And then... But then, you know... He died.
wonderful just to, you know, get away from everything and glide on the ocean like a gull in the air. That sounds lovely. But then my father died when I was young. He died when I was eight. He died at sea, in fact.
felt, I felt clean. Nothing to be ashamed of, dearie. You should have cut a throat of fruit on the bench. Why did you say that? Because it's true. You should have cut a throat the fruit old pal.
as if those little girls' bodies, the scarred bodies and broken bones, blood just washed his sins away. You know, like they were Jesus or something. Like a whole parade of little Jesuses. Understand. I, I felt the exact same way. And I think the reason that I worked for so long with the dead was because I envied them. You know, I, was, I was envious of the peace that they felt. You know, I hope that some of that peace would rub off on me. You know? Yeah. And it did suit me. It, it did suit me. And, I, and when I finally lost that job, I, I went a little crazy. You know? And it was because you know, I, I suddenly didn't know what to do anymore. You know, because my source of peace and comfort had been taken away. And so I, uh, I spent a, a couple of years in Colney Hatch Asylum. And uh, it's, it was because I just I couldn't think straight anymore. experience things. You felt the same way, didn't you, Mary? Yeah. I kept praying for the strength to do away with myself, but I couldn't. What kept you from doing it? Well, the church teaches that suicide is a mortal sin. You're a Catholic. 